Hi, I'm Dr. Katherine Mahan, and I'm a first year advisor at the University of Notre Dame. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a schedule plan in PATH. You can access PATH either through Inside ND or by going to classsearch.nd.edu. The home page for PATH will display search and advanced search filters that you will use to find classes. Note that the system defaults to the upcoming semester. Be sure to double check that you have correct, selected the correct semester. Let's start by searching for a math class, Calculus A. In the Any Subject filter, select the Mathematics Subject Code. Then click Search. This will display all math department classes being offered in the fall semester in a new results page. Click on your desired class and it will open a detailed course description in another new pane. There's a lot of helpful information here, including the course reference number for CRN that can be used for registration purposes, the course description, course meeting times and locations, and available section times. Pay attention to the number of seats available. If it says zero, that means that there are no open seats and the class is full. This view also lists any registration restrictions related to the class. For example, a class might be restricted to only upperclassmen or only students in particular colleges or majors. If you see a restriction and you are unsure if it applies to you, ask your advisor. In this case, there are no restrictions for Calculus A and the class is open to all undergraduate students. The last section to review are co-requisites. This lists any required tutorial, lab, or discussion sections that correspond with the class lecture. More on this later. When you've decided on what time the class you would like to select is, then click on it. Click Add to Plan, and then OK. This will open up another pane called My Plan, which will store all of the classes that you add to your plan. You can see that I have some classes added to my plan already. You'll notice that the calculus class I just added is showing a warning saying co-requisite for math 12350 required. This is the required tutorial for the class. It has a separate meeting time from the lecture and you'll need to select this as well. Add a section of math 12350 for your plan and the warning will go away. If you do not add the co-requisites for a class, you will not be able to register for it. Continue adding classes to your plan based on your academic requirements for your major and your college. There is a separate video on how to use advanced search filters to find classes that fulfill specific requirements. For now, I will continue to use the subject drop-down menu to locate the particular department and class that I want. In this case, writing and rhetoric. You can see that the section of writing and rhetoric that I selected conflicts with one of the other classes on my plan. To resolve this time conflict, you can select the class on your plan and click Remove from Plan. You should then go back and select a different section time of the course to add. You can 
Also use Remove from Plan as an option for any classes that you have changed your mind about and no longer want to keep on your plan. If for any reason you want to remove all classes from your plan and start over, just click Clear Plan. To view your classes in a weekly schedule, click the calendar icon in the top right hand corner of your My Plan pane. This gives you a view of your week at a glance so that you can see how your class schedule is arranged day to day. Once you are happy with your class selections and there are no errors, you can click Save Plan. Now, it is very important to know that PATH is just a planning tool. It does not register you for classes and it does not save you a spot in your classes. Classes that you have saved in your PATH plan could be full or otherwise unavailable when it comes time for you to register. So you will have to be flexible. Please be ready with backup options. The PATH system only allows you to save one plan so you should keep a list of alternate classes on a Google Doc or a Word document or written down somewhere where you can easily access it on registration day. Your advisor will be happy to talk with you more about how to plan for alternate options.